get a lot of shots, everybody come to the net. We, we just have to get more and more pucks to the net. I'm about to listen to pucks on net. We used to talk about it in Vancouver, getting pucks on net. And pucks on net. What were you saying about putting pucks on net? This is JT Miller with the Vancouver Canucks, and you're listening to Pucks on Net. Pucks on net and, and uh, driving and making a hard night on them. Live on tape. This isn't a real episode. Stop. It's a tease. Don't uh, tease them. This isn't Half-Life 3. Don't be like, it's happening. Don't worry. Don't worry, everyone. It's me, Gaben. We're doing Half-Life 3. <laughs> yeah, Ryan laughs at that. He didn't play Half-Life. He was he was, he was hanging out, drinking beers in the park, trying to pick up chicks. All I and know then about- he picked up the greatest chick of all time, Amanda. Yeah, look at you go. Let's show that ring. Show that it's, ring. It's silicon. I don't know my oh real one my yet. Oh, my God. Okay. Hope you're all doing well, gang. Shout Some, out to summer. my chick, Katie. Yeah, she's great. So we're two chicks. <laughs> the chicks are in town tomorrow night. It's Monday. Yeah, they're... Did Dumb, you know them? Uh, Dixie chicks are in yeah, town? Well, now they're just the chicks. Oh. Uh, why didn't they get rid of Dixie? Because Dixie's bad. Why? It means like South and, and oh. Rebel Flag stuff. Oh, the Mason... The Donna Dixon line? Don, yeah. Sure. I was about to say Mason Dixon line. Mason Raymond line? The Mason Raymond line with um, Manny Malhotra and Mason Raymond. And no, Torres. that's not all. He's no, not what on was that the line. Third, what was the third line? It was Mason Raymond. No, he was on the second line with Kessler. Thank no, that's why. That's th- why. Th- thank God this isn't a real oh episode. We don't, we don't have the chalkboard up so we can mention 2011. Yeah, we can't. it doesn't matter, guys. We're in, this isn't a real episode. <laughs> this is a teaser episode. Um, hope your summer's... Went swimmingly. I had a great summer. Did it was you? fantastic. Extremely busy in Deep Cove. How about you, Ryan? <laughs> <laughs> well, I love summer. The thing you got to know about a rash is he hates summer. I hate summer. I also, yes, I hate summer. He doesn't like spring either. <laughs> I love spring. Oh, it gets a little I warm. I literally love every season except for summer. This was the first year... Uh, what is it? Just, Justin McElroy uh, on oh, yeah. Twitter was like, this is the first year because of the forest fires and just how miserable summer is. in Vancouver. Like, I, I, it's a Fugazi. It's a Fugazi. People are like, oh, summer in Vancouver is so great. And then you go out and you realize that it's swamped with people. Everyone has like a fucking boom box playing a Vici over your head. You can't hear the you the beautiful ocean or kids playing. It's fucking and everywhere you go and kids are vaping. Everyone looks like they're in fucking euphoria and they all have STDs and shit. And you just you just want a little why bit don't, of coke. Why don't kids yeah. just like why don't kids dress the way they used to? Back no, then? why don't kids just hang out in the park listening to fucking Avicii? Chicago? Chicago, like they did back in the old good old days. You Chicago's know? awful. Steely. T- you tell me something, Ryan. You tell me something because yeah. this isn't a real episode. You're telling me you'd rather have the summer kids now or summer kids before, where they'd be in the park listening to Steely Dan smoking a joint, and everyone's calm the fuck down. I don't like uh, Avicii, and I don't like Steely Dan. And what? No, I don't need either one of them. Kids, punk this kids. This is the last. I'm kidding. This is the last episode of this. This show. isn't a real episode. I can't. Though. I know this is. I can't believe Ryan just said he doesn't like Steely Dan. Kids, how do you not like Steely Dan? Uh, they got reeling in the years. Yeah. And whatever, what else they got? Hey there, nineteen. Maria, my mighty heart is breaking. <laughs> I'll be in the Humvee. Anyway, uh, no, summer was summer. It's over. I am so glad it's September. I made a soup today. I'm excited for hockey. I need it. I want it. It's too much baseball, too much CFL. I've been going on YouTube lo- just looking at di- old clips. Uh-huh. Old clips at anything that YouTube wants to recommend me. Anything that involves ice, a stick, and a puck. That's where I've been. Ryan, in the meantime... Went all the way b- out east. I did. What'd you get, pal? Uh, well, I went to uh, I went to Nova Scotia for the first time and went to a wedding. Yeah. And uh, I made an effort to buy a bunch of swag, uh, Halifax Moosehead swag, swag, including um, this cowbell, which is literally the loudest thing in the world. Just jingle it a little bit. Oh my god! No, no, no! Enough! <laughs> enough! That's so loud! Oh my god, Ryan! You have to go edit that. <laughs> people are gonna be like, "That's that's like a trigger warning." We need yeah. to give people true. Audio that audio. is true. So that'll be an alert warning when JT Miller gets traded. <laughs> we'll be ringing the bell. When September what? September fifteenth rolls along, and we have an emergency podcast because Tyler Myers is a sensation. 
<laughs> and Jan Ruda is coming back on a two-year. He's a right-handed defenseman who can play in the bottom pair. Do you think that's going to happen? Um, I don't know. It seems kind of like the easiest thing that they could just, you know, go and just do that. I don't know. They'll do. They. I. I feel like they got one move ahead of them. I feel like. Uh, I, fe- I, I, I feel, feel like yeah. the move is picking up. Uh, is somebody going on LTIR and and a, and the Canucks picking up some very sensible backup goalie that comes off waivers on yeah. like September 30th? I'm listen. From we had we had such a money puck summer, and we didn't even t- <laughs> really talk about the 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 Pi Suter signing. Did we? No, we, we haven't really talked about. It was it. in the middle of summer. So this is the thing with Pi Suter signing again. Money money puck. Out of out of the wazoo, a two year deal, one point six million dollars, three point two million. Total. Does he know? He obviously doesn't have X or Twitter because he doesn't know about the negativity in this city. I mean, listen, this is the thing, guys. We paid Brandon Sutter like four point three seven five million dollars for five years, wanting him to score fifteen goals and have fifteen assists. He, <laughs> he, he did. He had twenty once. Yeah, and he had like eleven assists for thirty one points. You went and spent one point six million dollars on a guy. Listen, he's. This is he's not like a world beater, but he's such a Swiss army knife. He can do everything okay. He's not going to be the guy that you're going to rely on like a Manny Malhotra or defensive specialist. But at the same time, that's not what the Canucks need. Yeah. The Canucks needed I love Teddy Bluger as a fourth line guy first over the boards on the PK. But they get Pia Suter on this two-year deal. The one thing that I was super super worried about is if Miller or Pedersen are out for little bits of time, five, ten games, whatever. Yeah. And now, okay, you you have to push in Neil Zaman up. You got to push Teddy Bluger up. <laughs> uh, Sheldon dries up. See, that doesn't make sense. P.S. Sutter can come in. He can be. He'll be fine as a band aid. Mm-hmm. You needed a guy who can come in and be a proper band aid in those offensive situations, in in a top six role, just in case something happens. Knock on wood. It's going to be like when Matt Cook needed to get situated into a, a top six role. It's when like when Bertuzzi got suspended and Matt Cook played with Morrison and Naslin, and we're like, wait, wait a minute. Wait, why is it him? Really? Hey. Hey. He's got a pretty good. <laughs> 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 we don't need Todd Bertuzzi. <laughs> I don't think so. Um, I do want to interject because this is going on the podcast feed. So if you haven't been keeping up with us, we did two uh, YouTube segments about Never Ever, our new little uh, a little uh, series on our Pucks on Net YouTube channel, which you can get at youtube.com slash Pucks on Net. And if you're a Patreon backer or you've been thinking about being a Patreon backer, uh, we had a couple of vlogs this year. Um, we went and saw Barbie last month and we yeah, vlogged about was, it. That was Water Mania. That was great. Yeah, that was impressive. And we had another one. Uh, from April though, I think that was the ba- the the Mariners one. So oh, the Mariners one was good. Yeah, the Barbie one was good. We did one with the, going to the Canucks game yeah. to see them play the Sens. I have a question. Yes, sir. What's happening with Gita? She we just saw her on Saturday. How's she doing? Great. She's got a baby. She's got a baby. A little Rowan had people his. People thought that we oh, it was drama going on. Maybe Gita doesn't like us anymore. No, you fools! It she wasn't that. Me. A, hey. <laughs> You weren't there. Fuck you, dude. You weren't at the Rowan show. Yeah, because I'm working my ass off. That is what that is basically what she's, came up. She's literally my border buddy in culture. <laughs> yeah, he laughs because he's like, "Where's India? Where's Iranian?" <laughs> anyway, uh, no, everything. Yeah, everything's fine. When we're, we're gonna have Gita more on the show this. Yeah, week. and yeah. it's the perfect activity for a new mom to oh, have. Oh, such a good activity! Just to blame white men for everything. Let's fucking do it. Well, man. well, hang on, hang. hang. Gita, the trial of Ryan Shop, episode one. Episode seventeen. Episode seventeen, man. Uh, yeah, so uh, if you do want to support the show monetarily, you can go to patreon.com slash pucks on net, pledge a couple bucks. Uh, Help Ryan get a new couch. Yeah, we almost... This couch, I swear to God, I'm sinking into more and more each So day. I'm doing a chain. I'm, I have an, a big idea. Yes, sir. So this is a couch. This is an Ikea couch with no arms. No uh, arms. So it actually sits. We're actually leaning right back. It is great to lay on. It's great to have a little journey on Friday night. we're doing a professional media show... In which it's professional quorum, where we're laying stuff down in a serious manner. No jokes. We're not here to no joke. No jokes. We should be sitting. We're we... sitting talking to you only about facts. Yeah. And coursey. Yeah. And, and, and 
and ice. And we can't be sitting, sinking into a couch no. with unflattering angles. And guess what? Ryan and I grew up as chubby boys. And now we've grown up and we're still kind of little bit, but we both got dad bods. And when we see each other on the camera, we, guess what? Yeah, do we have loving partners that are hot as hell? Yes. But also, we need a couch that does us some favors. Yeah, I'm going to... I'm going to prop up the back of the couch. Who, so know, who knows 10 years from now, my kids are going on YouTube being like, what does dad look like he's giving up? Old, it's the couch, kids. It was the couch at the time. <laughs> Do not put it in 4K. No. No. Thank Just, God. I only do 1080p. Don't worry. Oh I have the option. God. I don't think oh I have the space. Oh, my God. Oh. Street, this, streets ahead. Streets ahead, this Ryan Schaff guy. <laughs> um, so when are we going to be back? Uh, we actually just looked at the calendar, and it's going to be Monday, September 25th. September 25th, people might ask, why is that so late? It's because, listen, I know tomorrow, listen, this is like, tomorrow, Donnie and Dolly, all the 650 shows, everyone's coming back. Every goddamn hockey th- show's coming back. This is not going to be really a lot of news until, like, mid-September, okay, guys? Everyone can just, you guys, the training camp's not for, like, three more weeks. And just you know what else? relax. If if something happens, if we get some ideas, I, you're gonna see it and hear it on our YouTube channel. Like literally, gonna we're gonna be there. We're we'll do an emergency pod in like two minutes. It'll be fine. You guys can live. You don't need us sitting here being like, "How are the Canucks gonna do this year, Ryan?" Oh, uh, I think for gonna- three weeks we're gonna be like, "Oh, they could be good if a lot of stuff uh, happens that <laughs> might start happening three weeks from now." <laughs> <laughs> um, so. <laughs> Listen. Listen, I've 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 spent a lot of kudos to Sakaris and Price for doing a show for dude, five days a week all dude, summer. All su- I mean, okay, well the, okay, I, I'll give give major credit to to those guys for uh covering like white gaps and B C Lions and But the Canucks Canadians. dialogue. There I remember oh, a week man. of a week of what Pius Cedar is gonna do. And his contributions. Listen, I needed to stay up on two flights, uh, two long six-hour flights to uh, the Maritimes. They they helped do it, but there's not that much to talk about. So we're gonna we're gonna you know kind of rein it in. We're not gonna milk we it dry. We just wanted to call. We just wanted to call you guys at four, two a.m. and be like, "You up?" And here's what we're up for you. And on Monday, September twenty fifth, when we do our first regular episode. We're going to drink this entire bottle of no, Seattle Kraken Fireball no, Whiskey. No, we're not. I Sorry, Fire, we are. When did we decide this? Just now. I don't want to become the kind of show that's like, okay, if you give us money, we're going to do fucked up shit. Has it come to that? Hang on. What's are the, we that now? Are is, we like the dudes on YouTube who do the mukbang videos? Do you know what a mukbang video is? Well, we, yeah. What is it, Ryan? It's uh, it's where they eat, eat the, the weird food? amount. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Eat... Are we? Is that who we are now? And then we're gonna have the weird screen cap, like where we're like, <laughs> like that. That's what we become. Um, you think? You think Heather Smart wants to see that? You think Travis Hunter Elliott? You think Richard the Hundred Acre Wood Honeycut wants to fucking hear that? You can get look at that. The, you think I don't come into the Discord? I remember all your names. You can come to just because yeah. I don't come into the Discord doesn't mean I don't love all of you. I, it would take a few hundred dollar pledges for us to do an episode where we drink. Dude, we went to we went to Canucks Media Karaoke. I'm not even. I'm not gonna tell. I'm not gonna say really what happened. But listen, I'll 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 end the show on this. Yeah, I told you this. So it was funny. We I drank. St- enough beers that it got to the point where I got home at 2 (laughs) a.m. And I went to, I drank water and I went to bed. I I took two apple and I went to bed. I woke up and then Katie was like, you have fun last night? I'm like, yeah. As I ate my leftover spaghetti at 9 a.m. And where did you get spaghetti? I make spaghetti. Oh, I thought you got it at craft. No, 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 no. (laughs) Um, She's like, you have fun? I'm like, yeah. And she's like, you hung over? I'm like, yeah. How'd you know? And she's like, well, when I woke up at 7, you were face down in the bed with both the pillows over the back of your head. And I'm like, yep. <laughs> <laughs> so if you think that was bad, wait till we do all this cinnamon cinnamon whiskey from uh, Seattle. <laughs> Joke's on. Uh, that's just a tease because I'm actually, this is not going to be drank. It is part of our uh, very integral set deck for uh, this upcoming season. Ryan's never heard of, heard of food coloring. Or I could just put some <laughs> apple. Uh, shit, I could just put some apple juice in this. Dang man, oh. Dang. So yeah, September twenty fifth, the podcast returns. We're you know what back. else is going to come back? Pucks on a fantasy league. 
Oh, thank God. I thought you said Puck's on the trivia, and I was about to have a heart attack. Please, I can't do it. I can't. Ryan, it was my idea. I got to kill my baby. It was too much work. I'll kill my baby. It was too much work. I think we'll do it um, uh, for special occasions. I'll only do trivia if if Yerky does it. And I know Yerky's going to make trivia that is so insane that we're going to ask him no longer to listen to the show. <laughs> we're going to tell Yerky, like, listen, we love you. You're easily the s- most learned hockey fan either Ryan or I know. But Jesus but goddamn Christ. Jesus goddamn Christ. Which, which 1921 Vancouver Canuck once famously ate two white spot burgers and, and founded Brandon, Manitoba. Trick after, question. Trick they one. were the millionaires. <laughs> Trick question. In this multiverse, Canada is is not a country. Um, <laughs> but yes, yeah, so yeah. uh, we're uh, September will be a, a little slow uh, start. But we're ever if anything happens, you will be here for you. Yeah, we'll do. A, a rash lives about eight feet, uh, eight hundred feet away from me. Oh, Ryan, edit that out. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> People know. People they don't know, know where I live. Huh? They don't know where I live. Above yet. the grounds of the old haunted Burger King. I don't say what I live above now. I don't need so. Ryan, it, listen, Ryan, if you're if you're Ryan. if you're somebody from Minnesota or hey Ryan, have you ever mentioned the peony on this podcast? I don't think so. We're done for. <laughs> We're gonna get swatted. <laughs> you oh just, you just doxed yourself. You doxed yourself so many years ago. How many times? How many? Okay, we're done. I love you guys. September twenty fifth. Ryan and I are gonna go to counseling. This is the thing pa- for Patreon members. <laughs> Ryan and I. <laughs> is the thing. I've watched enough couples therapy. Great show on Crave, by the way. Watch it with your significant other. Patreon bonus, if people want to pay for Ryan and I to go to friends therapy together, we will, and we will live stream it, but you have to pay for it. Well, let's see. I, uh, counseling individually costs about 168 bucks a uh, session. How bad do you want it, folks? How bad do you want it? That's my question. You- uh, I just want to say this. Your, Arash has been very upset with me for about 48 hours. Because, wait, wait, for what? Because I'm wearing Lululemon slides, the most comfortable thing in the world yeah. on these uh, tootsies. Yeah, Look at these things. That's great. Look at this. Beautiful. Just Google Chip Wilson and tell me. Uh, he doesn't work there anymore. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. <laughs> yeah, actually, so, actually, oh, Ryan. Ryan, using the old Adidas, Adidas method of getting out of ownership, huh? <laughs> or Puma. <laughs> or Puma. <laughs> Do, yeah, I wonder what those... Hey, Ryan, have you ever wondered what those three lines in Adidas stand for? All day I dream about sex. Sex all day in Dad's apartment. We'll see you September 25th, guys. Okay, we get a lot of shots. Everybody come to the net. We, we just have to get more and more pucks to the net. I'm about to listen to pucks on net. We used to talk about in Vancouver getting pucks on net. And pucks on net. What were you saying about putting pucks on net? This is JT Miller with the Vancouver Canucks, and you're listening to Pucks on Net. Pucks on net and, and uh, driving and making a hard night on them.